in between episodes, I went into the stats menu and I took a look at Morgana's persona because I wasn't entirely sure what he was saying. And I was correct. He is calling his persona Zoro. <laughs> that's that's funny. So it's like Puss in Boots and Zoro. Very nice. He has Garu and Dia. Weak to Zio, so we're gonna have to remember that. And strong against Garu. We are weak to Bufu and strong against Curses, but weak to Light. Okay. Or I guess that would be the Curse element. Not not death element or I guess they're pretty much the same thing yeah let's get out of this place oh we got another statue to pull Whoa. that looks like a jersey on, man what did you say I mean where are we oh no they found us all right let's fight oh, it's a pixie that's weird. All right. So I can change his tactics. Good. Let's see. Conserve heal, support, direct commands. Um, I was told that these tactics, they don't, like, they don't get expanded. Um, because in Persona 3, what happens was you had these commands, and then eventually you would unlock more. I don't know if that's gonna happen in this game because you can use direct commands, but all right, we're gonna try it out, and if it really doesn't work, well, I guess Merciless is hard enough. I want to save some SP. Nice. One. They can't land a hit. nice. Yeah, if we can beat this thing without... Actually, I should turn him off full assault, because now he's just using Garu every time. Actually, conserve your SP, because I need you to heal. When we find something that's weak to Garu, then I'll tell him to use SP. Yeah, we gotta conserve our SP here. Okay. Hmm. Alright, well, we could always come back for that guy. As long as they stay in those cages, they should be fine. Because it's not like Kamushida is out looking for them. For all we know, he should still be in the in his cell. We're here. Oh, finally, we're saved. It's not opening. Did you trick us, you jerk? Don't jump to conclusions. Over here. Hey, wait up! Where are we supposed to get out from here? There aren't even any windows! Ugh, amateur. This is the most basic of basics. What, do we go up? <laughs> a ventilation shaft? That's right! As I thought, you're a natural at this. It leads all the way outside. I see. All right. We just gotta get that metallic mesh off. And a one, and a... Ah! Well... Oh crap, the enemy didn't hear us, did they? At least you got it off. Seriously, we're finally getting out of here! You should wait on celebrating until you actually get out. 
Now get going. But what about you? There's something that I still have to do. We're going our separate ways. Don't get caught again, though. All right? Because I'm not saving you again. You better be careful, too. See ya. All right, pal. Stay safe. Those two seem useful. Especially the frizzy-haired one, if my judgment's right. Did we make it? Okay. You have returned to the real world. Welcome back. What? Huh? Returned? Does that mean we got away? Probably. You want to head to school? I think anymore. I think we're late. That anyways, that castle and and Kamoshida and that weird cat? Probably shouldn't call him a cat. What the hell's going on? What's with the yelling? Are you students of Shujin? Cutting classes, are we? Huh? Uh, no! We were trying to get to school, and we ended up at this weird castle! <sighs> what? They're not gonna listen. Oh, hand over your bag. You better not be doing any drugs. Dude, what the hell? Why would you think that? Are you his friend? <laughs> he was bullying No. Then you should go to school. Take him with you. All right. Like I'm trying to say, I don't know what's going on either. Ryuji, Ryuji, we passed let's go. By Shujin on our way here. There was nothing out of the ordinary about it. If you spout any more nonsense, I'll contact your school. Is that what you want? This guy. Come on, say something. Let's get going. Uh, that's not what I meant. Just leave it. They're not going to believe us. Is that guy for real? Fine, I'm going. They're not going to believe us either way. A minister of transport announcing his resignation. <laughs> Things are going as planned. Sai Nijima. That reminds me. Better to leave it be for now. Is this for real? I'm sure we came the same way. What's going on here? That's exactly what I wanted to ask you. We received a call from the police. What? The damn cop snitched on us after all. Hmm. It's rare not to see you alone. Where were you roaming around until this time? Uh, a, ca a castle? So you have no intention of giving an honest answer. What's this about a castle? Oh, this guy. I swear to God. Kamoshida? You seem so carefree, Sakamoto. Quite a difference from when you did morning practice for the track team. Shut up! It's your fault that it... How dare you speak that way to Mr. Kamoshida? Uh, there's not much leeway left for you, you know? He's the one that provoked me! Do you really want to be expelled? In any case, you'll have to explain yourself. Follow me. What? This is bullshit! Come now. I should have been more considerate, too. Let's just say that we were both to blame. Well, if you say so. Still, you're coming with me. It's undeniable that you're extremely late. Fine. By the way, you're that new transfer student, correct? Yes. I got lost on the way here. Have we met somewhere? Well, I saw a girl in your car. That's right. I remember now. Well, 
I'll overlook this just for today. I'm sure you've heard from the principal. But cause any trouble and you'll be expelled. Understand? Mm-hmm. At any rate, hurry up and go to the faculty office. I'm sure Ms. Kawakami's tired of waiting. Oh, right. We we kind of left her Good luck waiting. Trying to enjoy your new school life. That poor teacher. The school turned into an old castle. A talking cat. Yep. Are you hallucinating from an overdose? I won't put up with you if you're simply joking around. Look, if you're gonna ask me to tell you the story and then you're not gonna believe me, then what the hell do you want me to say? I'm going to have you continue the story. The one who received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves was an Olympic medalist. An alumnus from Shujin Academy. The PE teacher Suguru Kamoshida. It's true that what he did were deplorable crimes from indulging his desire. He confessed to it all. But there should have been no connection between the two of you since you had just transferred. Why did you target him? I'll tell you later. That's unacceptable. Try and recall it once again. Oh, cool. Okay, so if we ever forget what's going on, we can read that. Alright, let's go see Miss Kawakami. How could anyone be scared of me? Not really. Look. You know what? I'm not, I'm not gonna bother. Let's just... Let's just get to the faculty office. Man, these kids. Let's use the bathroom. The walls in there are disgusting. Okay, where is this faculty office? Mm. Go to the second floor. Okay, it's probably not 2D. Is it here? Oh. Well, there's the washroom. I'm guessing 2D is the faculty office then. No, it should be a classroom though. This school is like hot on their heels for their volleyball team. It's like no one else matters. Uh, hi. Unbelievable. Being over half a day late on your first day? You heard about the traffic accident, right? Can you explain yourself? I got lost. My train was late, and I got- and I got lost. How could you have been lost for this long? It's almost lunchtime. 
Yeah, because I got on the wrong train. Well, it's probably true that you're not used to the area yet, but you're still way too late. Can you stop being so suspicious of me? Will you pull yourself together? You were given fair warning yesterday. More importantly, I heard that you were caught along with that Sakamoto-kun. He helped me find the way to school. <sighs> and what's with that attitude about Don't him? Get involved with him, okay? He's nothing but trouble. He wasn't like that when he was devoting his time to track and field, though. Anyway, break's almost over. Classes will end after fifth period today because of the subway accident. See, you know about the accident. I'll have you introduce yourself when class resumes. Follow me. By the way, when you introduce yourself, be serious about it even if you're lying to the class, okay? Do not say anything unnecessary. Heh. <laughs> You're tempting me. You think that's him? Huh? The one in the rumors? She is definitely tempting me to cause trouble. Being super late on his first day? He really is insane. He looks normal, though. But he might slug us if we look him in the eye. <sighs> Settle down. Well, I'd like to introduce a transfer student. Today, we had him attend from the afternoon on since he wasn't feeling well. All right, please say something to the class. Sup. Nice to meet you. He seems quiet, but I bet when he loses it... I mean, he was arrested for assault, right? Uh, so... Your seat will be... Hmm. Over there, the one that's open. Sorry, but can the people nearby please share your textbooks with him for today? Ugh, this sucks. <sighs> Look, we can hear you. And apparently one of the students Lies. is injured. Huh? <sighs> Did you catch that? Do those two know each other? Ooh, does that mean he hit on her before transferring here? That means she's cheating on him with Mr. Kamashita. Then again, this is Takamaki-san we're talking about. For real, that side of the room is totally awful. Oh right, the volleyball rallies in two days. Everyone's just changed classes, so make sure you use that time to get to know each other. Well then, let's get class started. Who's on duty today? Everyone, please rise. Man, our class is so dysfunctional. This is just gonna be a fantastic year, I can tell. Hmm? What's wrong? Sorry, just a... Just a headache. Are you sure you're okay? Also, it seems like people are already talking about you, but I'm not the one who told them. Okay, it's fine. I can't even catch a break. Why do I have to deal with this? You should head straight home without stopping by anywhere. Sakura-san sounded pretty angry. Oh, and about Sakamoto-kun, don't get involved. Speak of the devil. What do you want? I heard the police caught you cutting classes today. <sighs> it was nothing. And you haven't dyed your hair back to black, either. Sorry about that. I'll be waiting on the rooftop. Alright. <sighs> See? That's why I don't want you getting involved. Understood? Look, I'm not gonna say anything to you, because... Why didn't you allow a student like him to transfer here? He's already started associating with Sakamoto. A oh my god. A record and the culprit of an assault case. At this rate, it'd be pointless how much I contribute to the school. Now don't be like that. This school counts on you, Kamashito-kun. You are our star. Still, a steady buildup is necessary behind such brilliance as well. 
Your troubles never seem to end, do they, Principal Kobayakawa? All right, I understand. I'll continue to do my best to answer your expectations of me. Frustration. I think that's the one word that can easily sum up everything that I'm feeling right now. Yeah, we should meet him at the rooftop. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and do that now. I really have no desire to talk to the other students right now because they're all jerks. There you are. Oh, nice little hangout here. Sorry for calling you up here like this. I bet Kawakami already told you stuff like, don't get involved with him, huh? Mm-hmm. How'd you know? <sighs> Figured as much. I mean, she doesn't seem like she's that bad. She just doesn't really have that much motivation to do much. Then again, we're in the same boat. Yeah, people don't like me either. I heard you got a criminal record. Everyone's talking about it. No wonder you were so gutsy. was all that that happened? You know, how we almost got killed at a castle. Beats me. It wasn't a dream, right? You remember it too, yeah? Mm-hmm. I remember the talking cat and everything. Well, just because we both remember it doesn't mean much, though. No one's gonna believe us. I mean, even if it was a dream, you saved me from Kamoshida. So yeah, uh, thanks. No problem. Kamoshida we saw there. Yeah, he wasn't wearing any clothes. You probably don't know about it, but there are some rumors about him. The guy we met earlier? Yeah, the ripped mop head. That asshole who was all full of himself at the castle. He we seems to think he's all that. Because he's some medalist who took the volleyball team to nationals. The way Kamoshida was king of that castle felt crazy real because of that. I wonder if we can go back to that castle again. Ah, forget it. It must have all been a dream. It has to be. Sorry to drag you out here like this. That's all I had to say. Alright. You know, we might be pretty similar. You know, you're alright. I feel like we're gonna get along just fine as troublemakers. You're better than everyone else I've met. I'm Ryuji Sakamoto. And I'm Nagato. I'll come talk if I see you around. Don't ignore me, all right? I won't. See ya. Okay. Well, we've had a long day. We finally made it back to the school. And it seems like Kawakami called home. So... Sojiro is probably going to be pissed and threatening to throw me out again, just like he always does every night. I'll but just it, this. Oh wow, I can save from here! That's amazing. Okay. Yeah, so Still what I'll do is we're just going to end here for today. And next time, we're going to go home and hopefully we don't get thrown out. Until then, thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>